All right, what's up, y'all? It's Jason Cunda from Hunting the Future. I'm videotaping this on my phone camera, so we'll see how this video goes. But I got two other cameras in my bag, a GoPro that I'll be wearing on my head. Hopefully, we'll see some turkeys tonight. We got, we're going up to my buddy Todd's, and we, we think we got them pinpointed. Tyler, my buddy's up here. That's who I'll be hunting with today, but um, we think we got them pinpointed pretty good. I know where they're at during deer season, and I've seen 30, 40 turkeys almost every afternoon in the same spot. So we'll see what happens, but I'm pretty excited about today. It's, it's raining right now. It's only 12.30, but should stop raining here at about 2 about two o'clock, 3 o'clock. But we'll be out there in the woods, hopefully get a turkey down today. Um, I don't know if we, t we haven't said anything yet, but our buddy yesterday had a bad hunting accident. So this turkey's going to be for him if we get one today. But thoughts and my thoughts and prayers go out to him and his family as he recovers from a bad hunting accident. We'll, we'll keep y'all updated on that. But y'all stay tuned for what's about to happen today and hopefully we get it done. Peace out. It's Tyler with Hunt in the Future. You better go get those two big goblins. Heck yeah. Give it a little chirp. Huh? Give it a chirp. Yesterday we were up on this ridge and there's a big open field and there's a bottom over here. These two hens came up. That's all I ended up seeing but then I was walking out and uh, I was just messing around giving some yelps and these four times ended up in the bottom across from the field and ended up roosting them. So hopefully they do the same thing tonight and we'll get on. There's the bottom. This is the big hill we're about to climb up. That's where we started. It's been a hike. A little out of breath, but we're almost off the top. Both ways. Both ways. What you got there, Tyler? Got a good old mushroom right there, boys. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, so it's the next day. What is today? The 27th, I think. Uh, April 27th. So yesterday, we seen three hens. We walked, what, you said 10 miles? Yeah, it, my phone died at 9.8 miles. 9.8, and we had to walk out because our buggy... Our buggy razor, whatever you want to call it, ain't working. Used a hoot out call. We ended up getting the bird to gobble. Ended up walking all the way back around this holler. There's a field on top, and there's this real nice steep slope right here, and he's he's uh, roosted right there. So we're gonna set up in between him 
in that field. We think he's going he's going to fly up to that field. So hopefully he's going to fly down. It's our decoys before he gets to the field, and we're going to smoke him. So stay Let's tuned, baby. Yeah. Uh, well, we came in this morning, as you can tell, they were gobbling. Uh, that turkey obviously knew there was a hen a little ways down, and uh, he flew down perfect. He was probably about 70, 80 yards. I didn't feel, I didn't want to shoot that far. Uh, but he knew that hen was down there, and he went and got with that hen. So, me and Jason got the stalking decoy, and uh, tried walking down this way, and Two jakes popped up. Yeah. Alright, let's wrap this video up. This is a decent, I mean, it's a decent video. We got some hens yeah. on the video, some deer. Yep. Yeah. Big old Tom. <laughs> and he didn't hit the dirt. <laughs> Maybe this weekend, though, you know. Got some school stuff to do. Jason got work. I got work, yeah. you know. We'll see but, what happens. We'll try to get it done. We're going to try to get him done. He coming back. He ain't going nowhere. Stay tuned, hunting the future, baby. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. <laughs>